Okay, here we are in round two. Um, this hand is a little bit sketchy, but I'm going to keep. As long as we draw any land, we'll have access to all, all our colors. We got Rootwalla. Alright, we got two drop. It's a little sketchy, but there's an 85% chance we draw a second land. And I hate to mulligan. Perfect. Um, sure. Predatory Slither. Go. Depends on what we see next. Probably leaning towards the root wall next. No, well, he's pretty annoying. Uh, so in retrospect, I think I'm actually going to go with the, um, Verdant Haven. Boy, that's going to be bad. If he, uh, has a Rumbling Baloth, this turn makes it a 5-5. Five, five. That's going to be hard. Uh, I'd like to be able to keep Chandra's Outrage open, if at all possible. Gain two life. Try to ramp up into our bigger stuff if possible. Alright, so it's not going to be a beast. Charging Griffin is acceptable. Alright, so. <coughs> Probably here we just drop the Rumbling Baloth. Uh, I'll go ahead and offer the trade with the Charging Griffin. I do not think it will be accepted. And so it goes. I assume the land drop there hurt. Bringing up the Battle Sliver would have been pretty nice. Pillar filled ox, okay. So, let's see, we attack in. <coughs> he can either take it or he can double block. He did leave up giant growth mana. So, hmm. it's a little interesting. I think I go ahead and attack in and try and bait out a giant growth that can shot Chandra's Outrage. And if not, either get in for four or I'll trade with the Advocate of the Beast. It's not ideal. But I think trying to bait out that giant growth is worth it. He just takes out. That says, I'll take it. And then in that case, Fine to go ahead and drop another Rumbling Baloth. Uh, would really like to hit an extra land. Then I could have done Battle Sliver or Root Wallop plus Predatory Sliver or Primeval Bounty. And that is an issue. Naturalize will be coming in. And that is an issue. So he's going to put that on the Griffin, I'm assuming. This is very good. He's going to put it on that. Okay. Well, good news is he only got one card left in hand. Bad news is it's going to do something. This we know. Alright. Four mana. So we do have a couple two drops we can play. I guess that's the best we can do right now. Um, plays a land, he gets three life. Yeesh, 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 yeesh. This is very, very tricky. 
Naturalize is coming in. This we know. Um, yeah. I think that's the best we can do. We could attack with the with the Baloths. He blocks it with a Pillar Field Ox, takes four, and then we Chandra's Outrage. Um, and that takes him down to uh, eight, essentially. Gets rid of the Pillar Field Ox, but then we have Sliver, Baloth, and a heap of cards in hand. I don't know that that's any better. Um, Maybe that is a little bit better. Yeah, alright. We'll, we'll add two for one ourselves. Eh, alright, no, I think I'll go with the 2 2 drop plan. Hopefully, next turn we can get a battle sliver down. Okay. Yeah. An equal bounty bed. Alright, I guess that too. It's out of cards. He's actually got beasts now. Well, that's really bad. Yeah, him having two creatures to follow that up is like worst case scenario. Um, so, Shandra's Outrage, the Beast, we don't really have attacks. Yeah, this is this is no good. Battle sliver. Good news is he doesn't super have attacks either, so. So I guess we just put out the Battle Sliver. See, I gotta just, man. Might have a, it's, it's gonna be really tough to come back on this one. Um, but I'm not totally giving up hope yet. I don't think he really has attacks either. Take four. He's got this thing going. Oh, man. So, is he going to distribute? So let's see what happens. Shatters outrage a beast and attack with everybody. Five seven. Maybe trade with the battle sliver. And then they can trade and trade. And then I'm not getting through enough damage. Sorry, I, if I can't, uh, Shandra's Outrage, that. Um, hmm. Trade, trade, it's taking kind of a lot. I 
think I have to attack. I don't think it's going to work either anyway, but I think I have to. I guess I don't attack with the Voracious Worm. Yeah. Because like, you can just do stuff. Oh, he's got Vigilant. Yeah. Yeah, this is no good. We're basically hoping he, like, clicks through blocks. <laughs> So this card has gotten him two beast tokens, uh, three plus one, plus one counters, and three life, which is pretty good for one card. Pretty good. So naturalized comes in. He is taking eight. Did have to respect the giant growth bluff. Is this fatal? Three. No, we can jump block. All right. Five, seven, yeah. Go to one. Predatory sliver. Okay. Yeah, and the bonus guy. Yeah. Must be nice. Must be nice. Deck, bro. Of course, your shield doesn't do anything. I'm not gonna show that to him. Um, yeah, let's just see if he clicks through his attack, his declare blocker step. blocks a second ago when you were taking lethal. Make him do it. Make him do it. Alright, so he's got some flyers. Um, I don't think I I don't have any anti-flying in my stuff. Um white green. Possibly the thunder strike comes in. Um I was pretty sure I took a naturalize. I guess not. All right then. Well, um, it's dragon egg, lightning talons, maybe lightning talons. Demolish. Not gonna work on that thing. night pack um, try and be a little bit more aggressive yeah I really thought we had a freaking naturalize 
did the moto screw me? Because I, I think I did the the select, and then I was talking about other stuff, waiting for the clock to tick down. Did I screw that up somehow? No, I have to check the tape. Check the tape. I would like to challenge that ruling on the field. Get a yellow, yeah, uh, red flag out of my pocket here. Um, maybe that. What would, I, what would I cut for that then? Rangers Guile. I think I want to keep that. Um, just now, especially with two enchant or two auras. Potentially, he could probably has a pacifism somewhere in his deck, or whatever. Or the uh, not the enlarge the hunt the weak. So I can't think of anything I've cut for it. So the first. Yep. Were we? Yeah. This is. If we had one more land, so the Cecilia Corsair Shield would be in business. Um, so we can Academy Raider into Lightning Talons. It's going to be fairly hard for him to deal with. There's, it's still 70% we draw a land by turn three, but like if we don't. Nah, I think we mulligan. This is... Yeah, yeah, this is a little bit better. Got Rootwalla with the Lightning Talons. That can be a clock. Alright. If we knew we were going to draw a land, I would have preferred the first one. Now I draw you, of course. All right. Well, Rootwalla, and see what we draw next turn. We might lightning talent it up. We might not. Master of Diversion. Okay. Yeah, we take that. Shivan Dragon. All right. So we can lightning talent it up. Get in for five, or we can. I think it's better to attack the root walla pump and freight predatory sliver, especially with the battle sliver on deck. We draw land. is going to be hard to do. <sighs> well, it's a little awkward here. I think we lightning talent up the root walla and attack in with both of them. If he wants to trade the predatory sliver for the master diversions, I guess that's okay. And we are going to leave up green mana, so. He just takes it. Okay. So he goes to nine. It's a pretty aggressive. Pump him next turn, potentially. Saw him off right. Okay. And he gained four life. That hurts. So he's just like main decking that. I play game one, I show no artifacts or enchantments, and he leaves it in. So it goes. So it goes. And I can't hit land. I'm going to attack in.
So is he going to force me to pump? Pump it is. And then he probably just takes me down with the uh, thingy. So I'm trying to remember my deck. I think I had two five drops, a six drop, and a seven drop in the deck. And I have all of them in my hand and four land. Yep. That's the thing. Probably did. I think I've made all the right decisions. I think it was just a little too risky to try and keep that opening hand. I mean, it could have worked out, but I think it was better to mulligan. Yeah. Alright, so I chump block and. Evil Bounty says, win the game next turn or you die. <laughs> Can they just print that? Shadow's Outrage. Okay, that's great. All right. Yeah. That's that. All right. So, yeah. So it goes sometimes. Uh, see you around three. 